welcome to mere, uh, a reaction slash review of Hatched, and I'm doing a video with my friend again, Wyatt, and we did a reaction slash review to Garfield Gets Real, and uh, that was something. <laughs> and uh, we also did one to Jungle Shuffle, which was also... It, which was also really wild. So this time we're doing Hatched, which is another wild, what looks to be wild, bad animated film. Hmm. Why, are you there? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was just... I was, I was just letting you go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. But uh, anyways, guys, why you ready? Let's get right into it. Hey! Don't make me get tough, because it's tiring. Oh, that voice acting. <laughs> oh, God. Well, I think this is Korean or something, so. Oh, okay. So that's why the the lips don't really match that well? Okay. Well, I'll, I'll let yeah. it slide then. I also, guess. why it doesn't make sense. Yeah. True, you're right. Open sesame. <laughs> <laughs> that, line, that line delivery. Uh, it was so bad, but it was funny. Yeah, that really looks like I'm floating. Yeah, what? Yeah, what the? Oh, so that this is like a secret agent thing, like, you know? I don't know. Is it? It just it just gets worse from here. It's yeah. Just... Now. <laughs> Random slow mo. Tiny, your turn. Oh, get it. His name is Tiny. Yeah, his name is his name is Tiny, but he's fat. Cluck Norris, you okay? What's his name? Cluck Norris. Oh, <laughs> that's so bad. That's so bad. His name is Cluck Norris. Of course yes. it is. Best to be the first chickens to fly. So that's their plan. They're trying to become the first chickens to fly. Okay. Yeah. I did not know that oh, with the intro. No. What the hell is that thing? Oh my, it's... What is that thing? I don't know, but it's just like a cripple riding around. Well, is it like a fish bee thing? What even is that? Oh my god, it's like a mutant abomination. <laughs> I mean, it's like Garfield gets... Uh, yeah, Garfield gets real. With... With what? Garfield yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That, that... And all the characters look hideous. Yeah. Come on, guys. Our goal is to keep everyone on our farm safe, especially from that vile, vexing vulture. Boy, that's hard to say. So the plot is to protect the farm, but they never said that. They said that they were going to be the first chickens to fly. So I, I'm just honest. I'm so confused. It's a very deep character because it has many different motivations. Yeah. But I think it's I think it's too it's too deep for me. It's it's way too confusing. See ya next fall. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to Brazil. <laughs> and Mr. Waddlesworth. <laughs> now that's what I call a sitting duck. <laughs> I hate that. I hate that so much. What is that design? Is that like a cow? But I don't know. But his flesh <laughs> is coming from his nostril. So how does he breathe? Yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. How does he breathe while he talks? What the hell is that thing? Yeah, no, it's it's the uh, rip off scrap too. It is. So that means that thing dies like a bunch. It's like a worm plus a rat. It just doesn't look right. Like, tail, yeah, the worm tail and then, like, the worm... Does that look like a beaver? I don't know what that thing is, but it's, like, its arms are way too thin to be arms. Is that a restaurant? Because I don't think that's a great name for a restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's how they introduce the vulture, just, like, just that? <laughs> that cut, though. Quiet. What is this? What? What were the twists and turns? Is it? What? What were the? Oh no! <laughs> uh. Speaking the flock, huh? Yeah. Oh no! 
Why, how does a bird even have a mustache on their beak in the first place? I wonder what he reminds me of. Yeah, yeah, me, me too. But, I mean, yeah, no, no, uh, fascist dictator. Uh, no, but, but seriously though, how does a a be like a bird grow a mustache on their beak? We're both feed. I don't. It, it does. Yeah, 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 true. Yeah, I mean, he has a, like, triangle phone that I don't know what he's using for, but, uh, okay. The commander's always right, even when he's wrong. That's horrible advice. <laughs> that is legit horrible advice. A commander is right, even when he's wrong. Like, I don't know, it's just stupid. <laughs> I don't want him to get on. Yeah, same. I want him to die. <laughs> same. Same. Like same. I mean... <laughs> Thanks! But don't tell her that I asked you. Something bad's about to happen. So wait. What was that? Did th does this thing have spidey sense? Because... Because he was like, something's about to go wrong as the vulture was about to, like, catch him. So, does that mean he has spidey sense? I swear to God. Please, Daddy. Can you open up your food storage? We're so hungry. It is a restaurant that's just titled Food. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh my god, that's a terrible name for a food store. No way! There's some kind of UFO out there too! Oh my god, how can you not tell? I mean, I know UFO means unidentified flying object, so like, I guess that works, but like... How would you not know that it's a vulture? Like, it, it looks so much I like... Yeah, and then and then you're just like, that's that's a UFO. What? Well, that's a Jurassic. What is this crap, Angry Birds? <laughs> you're right. You're right. <laughs> they toasted my hairdo. <laughs> oh boy. Well, they're dead. <laughs> well, uh, that's bye-bye for them. How did they get out? Yeah, how? How did they survive that? How did they survive that? Legit. There's no way they should have survived that. How did those bastards live? <laughs> yeah, wait, what? How? That, legit, there should be so many characters that die in, like, the span of, like, a minute, and none of them die. Well, well, well. What do we have here? Oh my god, he's also German. Yeah, he's German. He's German! <laughs> oh. Yeah, oh my god. Are you serious? <sighs> what? Wait. I can't take this anymore. Did this thing just teleports wherever it wants to? Like, well, it was, it's like all powerful. Yeah. But I don't know why, like, what, what's it, what's its purpose, though, in the film? I hate building montages so much. Oh, same. It's so filler. It, it's so filler. Also, I like how they can't recognize him flying. They call him a monster, but then they have a perfect cardboard cut out of him. Like, they know what he looks like. Yeah! But they just don't, they, they just don't know what he looks like in real life. Keep an eye out for these guys. Got it? Yeah. Well, I mean, those are nice silhouettes, but I'm not going to know what they look like in real life. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like, why do you, like, if they're not good at knowing, like, what they look like in real life, but they have a silhouette of the person, then that's not a good sign. So I'm guessing this vulture is after the yellow thing. Because it has powers. I don't know. And I'm guessing he just went after the wrong thing. He just went after a white duck. No, it's Meryl Jeep. Who's pop? Meryl Jeep. These pun names are terrible. Love is a funny and wonderful thing. It makes me sing. Oh, love is a... Oh, no. No. Oh, no. 
Oh my god! We're just going. You're just gonna dive into the realm of Veggie Tales. What now, Commander? Hmm. Magic can take care of himself. His name is Magic. Too. His name is literally Magic. And he has magical power. Oh my god! What a terrible name. I think he, he That's even magic. worse than Ch uh, Cluck Norris and whatever it's called. Here goes. You're right. Did it have like time bending powers or is it like the force? Is it the force or like time bending powers? Who the hell is the honestly like I don't even know. <laughs> oh yeah, you're right. You're right. It's one of those things. I'll use my power. Oh, he can like predict the future? Well, he just has time powers, basically. I thought he was turning it back. It looked like he was fast forwarding. Yeah. I I think he just has time powers and that's really it. Cause they don't they don't really show his powers off that well. But Especially why is he in a car? Yeah, why you're why right. Is why is he in a car? This is honestly so anticlimactic. There's no tension at all. In well this yeah. Movie. Because like the I the guess main I'm expecting too much from it. You're you you are right, but like but the thing is as well is the fact that since like magic has like time bending powers and like a lot of like other powers, it just makes him seem way too overpowered to the point where like what is he gonna like what can anybody do to stop him? <laughs> What the? What? What is happening? This is the best part. What? <laughs> How? Bye bye. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? How? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! So chickpeas dead. Oh, yeah, 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 you're right, because he went up at the, you know, yeah. How, though? Legit. How does that happen? How do they get shot out of the thing with the cannon, and then they they shoot Well, they, they remained in midair, then they shot and killed Chippy. Yeah, how do they remain in midair? That scene was just wow. It was just wow. That was the culmination of it. Of just so many physics just broken in one moment. Honestly, why? What do you think of this film? I I thought it would be more more just consistently funny, like a Pet Force was. Oh yeah, where it was like the animation was so insane that. Oh, right, and you're not you're not watching it to be to have it you know be a good movie. You're just watching it to be you know insane. So yeah, good, but it like just, it like good. Pet Force was definitely bad because you know. It was just like everything was just bonkers about that film. It was so funny. This one was just boring. It, I would say, but like it wasn't as boring as Garfield gets real. Cause I, no. cause Garfield gets real had like such a generic plot. Cause it was like, oh, they go into the quote unquote real world, I guess. But at least that one had like uh, Eli and stuff. Oh yeah, Eli though. But the this thing is, is that they sat around do doing nothing. They really did. That was funny to see, but it went on for too long. This one has no characters, nothing. Yeah, you're... The scene at the end when magic shoots chickpea. Oh, them. yeah, that scene at the end where they break all laws of physics, That that is... That's like the only good scene in the film. It definitely was not worth it, though. Yeah, I mean... I just... I, I watched it over, like, you know, a few days. Uh, I remember it just being funny. But maybe it's just first time through type of thing. You know? I mean, but this was my first time through, and I just thought it was eh. I mean, the yeah, plot I, the plot was very... I don't know. I don't know how to put it. It wasn't that there great. There wasn't a plot. There really was. I mean, there was... There I'd say there was, but like they didn't really do well like of explaining these things. 
They just said, oh yeah, here's the plot, just go along with it. And that was really it. They never explained anything. Which was really annoying. I think I, think I understood Garfield gets real well from that. True, yeah. I, yeah. And then Jungle Shuffle, I, I understood the plot in that. And it, it was Jungle funny. Shuffle. Jungle Shuffle is definitely the best out of all of them. Yeah, out of, well, yeah. Jungle Shuffle was fun. It was fun to do. It was also really funny. Because, like, yeah. That one's really good. Especially with the screaming worm. Yes. That <laughs> that that is the best. Yeah, but it was actually it actually managed to be pretty entertaining. Yeah, you're right. I mean it didn't actually have a bad plot, I'd say, either. Right. Generic, but it kept your interest. Yeah. And then of course there's the added bonus of the screaming thing and And just right. just funny character designs and other stuff like that. Right. The apes. Oh yeah, the apes were funny. And then also that, like, one twist as well. The monkey being evil. <laughs> yeah, that was kind of fun. That, that was funny. And also the dragon thing. That that was... Yeah. They that, actually had some decent things in that. Oh, yeah. The, I mean, they, yeah. The designs weren't actually... Some some weren't bad, yeah. But, like, this was just... Wow. This It's funny, though, because Jungle Shuffle, the main character is actually voiced by Drake from Drake and Josh. Yeah, I, I yeah, I, I actually learned that after doing the video, cause I I kind of had a feeling. But uh, yeah. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. What do you guys think of this this movie? <laughs> Leave that down in the comments down below. Leave a like, and subscribe to my channel. See you in the next one. Bye. Yeah.